Hello dear learners, welcome back. You have started watching my YouTube channel, The Wireless Tutor. Dear friends, this video is the part of Odisha River System. Today we are going to discuss about another important river, Buddha Balang. Buddha Balang is one of the six prominent rivers of Odisha. Friends, as I have collected most of the information that are highly important, for the examination's point of view. So I assure you, if any questions is asked, then there is a chance that that may cover in this video. I always believe in pursuing more information in less time. Therefore, we should start our discussion without any further delay. Let's start. Dear friends, now you can see the River map of Odisha in the northeast side, West Bengal is situated. In the north portion, Jharkhand is situated. There are so many rivers flowing through Odisha. This one is Mahanadi, and after it, this river is Brahmani, which is formed by the confluence of Sankh and Quail. Now, this river is Baitarani, Salandi is its prominent tributary. Now, as you can see, that that this, this river is called Budhavalan. Budhavalan mostly flows through two districts, that is Mavirbhans and Balaiswar. Then it flows into the Bay of Bengal. Dear friends, let us know some fact about Budhavalan river. This river is otherwise called as Balang river. It originates from Simlipala hills. It originates from Simlipal Hills and plunks through Barepani Falls. That means it enters into the plain areas from the plateau. Barepani Waterfall is the second highest waterfall in India, which is located in Simlipal National Park. This one is the Barepani Waterfall. It looks so beautiful and it, this place is also famous for the tourist attraction. Now go to the next point. It is about 175 km long and has a total catchment area of about 4840 square kilometer. That means its basin area is about 4840 square kilometer. Now go to the next point. Its major tributaries are Son, the Gangadhar, and the Katra. In the next slide, we will discuss about um, many more other tributaries of Budhavalan. Now go to the next point. It is one of the 19th most polluted rivers of Odisha, according to a report by Central Pollution Control Board. According to Central Pollution Control Board, it is the 19th most polluted rivers of Odisha. Now go to the next slide. Now we should know the major tributaries of Budhavalan River. Katranal, which meets the river near Jankapahadi village. Katranal is, Katranal is its major tributary which meets Budhapalang river at Jankapahadi village. Next point, Palpala and Chipat, both of which are hill streams. Those are arising from the Simlipa hills. Son, Gangadhar and Katra, these are the major tributaries of Budhapalang that are mentioned by the Central Pollution Control Board. Kalo, Sanjo, Deo, Gangahari, and Sunai. These are also the tributaries of Budhavalan. These are mentioned by a document prepared by the Department of Water Resources of Odisha. Now go to the next slide. Let us know the course of Budhavalan river. It originates from the Simlipal hills, as you know, in Mayurvans district of Odisha. 
up to its origin up to some distance it flows through barhepani waterfall which was the second highest waterfall in india it was located in chimlipal national park after the barhepani waterfall then it it flows in a northern it flows in a northerly direction up to the viras karanjapal in bangriposi police station after the village karanjapali then it moves northeast it moves northeast then it flows along the railway track up to the village jankopahadi after the village jankopahadi it changes its course and move to south to meet its tributary katranal after that after that this river passes through the district headquarter of moirbhanj that is known as baripada then after that it later flows through the baleswar district for a few kilometer then it drains into the bay of bengal at balramgadi village so balramgadi village is the mouth of mouth of budabalang river or it it falls into the bay of bengal at balramgadi village now go to the next slide now let us see some check dams and projects as there are no major dams which are constructed across this river only there are few check dams on its tributaries and some minor irrigation projects so there is no major dams constructed but there are some minor irrigation projects and some check dams there is a check dam on katranal katranal is the tributary of budabalang it is situated near jankwadi village there is also a minor irrigation project on palpalanal on palpalanal palpalanal is also the tributary of budabalang river which is which is situated near simlipal national park this project aim to provide water for irrigation and drinking purpose to the nearby villages this is all about this river budhavalan i hope this video is more informative for you if you find this video helpful for your exam then please support my channel and thank you for watching